A liability? Seriously? You'd never pass for Delta. An interpreter, then. You don't even speak Arabic. <sighs> I'm wasting my I'm breath. I'm not taking a vote here. Okay, you're staying back. I want you here with Felix and Woods. Well, if you have this figured out, I'm not just going to sit around. I'm going out. Let her go. Moving on. Adley, you sure that's all the lie we told you? Before you executed him? You're in my world now, Marshal. Gonna have to grow up fast. I'm listening. Alawi knew the Pantheon had a presence in Iraq. It's part of the technology exchange with Saddam Hussein. Pantheon gets cover in facilities. Hussein gets access to an experimental weapon. But Alawi didn't know what the weapon was? No. Only that they're calling it the Cradle. The Cradle? The cradle. It's in Iraq right now. Presumably. Alawi said it was in transit to a remote palace. Demonstrations taking place in a bunker underneath. Hussein is a world-class collector of palaces. There are many on this map alone. Alawi was confident he knew the one. Yes. This one. Let's take a first-hand look then. We'll finalize plans soon and we'll ship out. Dismiss. I'll take these. Enjoy them, I brought them for you. Figured. You don't usually smoke the shit brands. Don't want you raising your standards. Well, there's never been a better time to be cheap as hell. Hey. Yeah. Listen, I understand that in your own Adler ass way, you invited us to this place. Maybe you've got squatters rights, but don't much care. You got a point? What I do care about, what I need you to understand is that this here is my team. You need us more than we need you, okay? We broke you out of that black site, and I just need an excuse to send you back. Bottom line, you're a stranger to me. All I got on you is your reputation, and it ain't all roses, Adler. Well, you don't have to trust me, Marshal. But it might be best if you do for you and your team. I'll be the judge of that. Ooh, a contest. So exciting. Should I get a ruler? By the way, Adler, I'm still waiting to get paid. I had a little something stashed for you upstairs, but it seems I was robbed while on vacation. Nah, you just loaned it to us. Forgot to tell you, all. Surprise. I just think you and I should spend some quality time together. We should get plenty in Iraq. My thoughts exactly. Sub case. Adler expects everyone to Michael Jordan when he says jump, but I don't do no questions asked. Cat knows a lot more than he lets on. You've heard the rumors. Adler's a wildfire. Burns through whatever's in his way if he gets the job done. Thing is, I'm not dancing to that tune. We're putting an end to the Pantheon and getting out of this thing alive. Tell me about it. Woods is really maxing out his credit on this one. But he's got a hell of a large line of it. Figuring this line of work, you'll end up in all sorts of crosshairs. But the CIA's dedicated my life to our country, you know? I believed in its potential. Still do, despite everything. 
After the Capitol Station? Well, I don't see the cavalry coming either. We're all there is. He spent the last year gunning for the old guard at Langley. Maybe he was the mole behind Panama, too. If it wasn't Adler, someone sure did a bang-up job making it look that way. I don't know, man. Can't say it all adds up. Sounds good. Poor Savati. The nightlife around here is limited to owls and jackals. Please excuse me, Case. Unlike others, I cannot step away at the moment. I've known Adler since Nam. Give it 20 years. He'll grow on you. So, here we are. I'm sure he is. And so are a lot of operatives up on the memorial wall. A big heart will weigh you down. I don't know if you had the pleasure of working with Jason Hudson. He was one of the casualties back in Panama. Just weeks before he died, he told me about a paramilitary group that may have infiltrated the CIA. Guess what they were called? Hudson seemed to believe they were homegrown, maybe transnational, but American-dominated. Most likely military and intelligence expats. The recruits seem Western-trained, English-speaking. They know how to think like us, which makes them especially dangerous. After Frank got out of Walter Reed, the news was that I put him in that chair. I was the one who compromised his Panama mission in 89, got Hudson and Mason killed, Woods injured. All bullshit. When I skipped town, I went silent on him, on everyone. Better he hate me than get caught in the net, but I guess it didn't matter in the end. So yeah, he did take a leap. He's loyal. Last March, someone produced documents showing encrypted transfers. From the drug lord Raul Menendez to my personal bank account. I got wind of it before Langley called me in from Morocco. Decided not to get on that plane. I'd been in contact with Alawi since the beginning of the year. He wanted a red carpet out of Iraq and was willing to talk for it. As a minister of defense, his value was high. And he knew it. After coalition forces attacked, well, his timeline changed. I was to meet him in Kuwait and supply passage through Europe. Seems I wasn't the only one who knew his plans. Uh-huh. It's been a few months since I went off the grid, but leads have been slow to turn up. Though I do get one anonymous tip out of Avalon. Pantheon may be partnering with one of the major crime factions there. And potentially reaching out to others as well. I've offered a small sum to a one-time asset of mine to follow up. She has an axe to grind there, so I'd be surprised if she turns me down. <laughs> 